This not only was a successful title defense from Zhang Wei Li, but this was seeing her tested in a way that you haven't really seen her tested before, but there was some controversy as well, AJ, and we need to, of course, talk about controversy. Yan Xiaonan, this is following the end of round one, and as she's getting up, wobbles. Oh, she's there, but she's not there, right? Even Wei Li is all like, oh, what's going on? I thought I got the finish. She's looking around. Listen, it's unfortunate, AJ, but the reality is I've been there. And once you woke up from that nice little nap that you took, you don't really know what's going on. You're looking around. The number one feeling that I can equate it to is confusion. You're just confused. You don't know where you're at. You don't know what exactly happened. You don't know where, what, how much time has elapsed. But she came up from that, recovered, and then fought for four more rounds, AJ. So a little bit of controversy right there. What do you attribute this to first? Should Jason Herzog have been like, hey, fight's over, you were asleep, you cannot continue, but because she made it to her feet, does that mean, hey, you're still able to fight? What do you think? Uh, this is a rough one, Derek, because I had this thought while the fight was going on. If that's my athlete in there fighting, it truly depends on the dog that, that's in that athlete. Because at some points, you're going to, like, as a coach, you're going to want to be, like, saying, nah, like, that fight was over. You know, the, we we all saw the 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 tiredness and the, and the the effort that needed to be driven out of Yan Zhanon after after the situation that happened. But then sometimes you don't want that that lead to be called. You know what I'm saying? You don't you don't want that outcome to happen if your fighter can still keep it going. And to your point, Derek, she fought four more rounds after this. There's no doubting the dog in Yan Xiaonan, so it's hard to take that away from her at the same point. Yeah, so it was, it was a valiant effort, right? Yan Xiaonan did what she was supposed to do. She was given an opportunity, and she tested Wei Li. But the reality of the situation was you have to attribute part of that to Wei Li burning her arms out, trying to get the choke, trying to get the choke, right? And she never really got it. The following round, she flattens her out, gets her belly down, starts beating on her with punches, and they just never give her the finish. Yan Xiaonan did just enough in the eyes of the, of the referees to continue the fight, which is what being a champion is about. You have to fight through the adversity. So she was tested. It was a closer fight than it seemed, but if you really look at the numbers, Wei Li dominated.